Okay, today we're going to be removing tooth number 25. Tooth 25 has some recurring infection on the lingual. Previously, we had done a Gerastore repair, and this was um, about over a year and a half ago. And it healed well, and then she ended up having <coughs> infection again. So we're going to be taking this tooth out, bone grafting the socket, giving her a stay plate, and then we'll be prepping this site for an implant later. Okay. We're using the proximator now. It's kind of like a bigger periotome actually. Here, we're putting our graft in now. This is a combination of um, Dynagraft D, a cell, and mineralized freeze dried bone. It's a two and a half month healing of the extraction of bone graft in the number 25 cell. If any of this bothers you, just let me know, okay? Mm -hmm. For unlike grafting, I do use a membrane. However, for contained grafting, like you saw with the extraction socket and no lingual bone, I don't use a membrane.
So this is a three week look at the uh, implant placement in the number 25 site. And we'll take a look at the x-ray next. This is the six week healing of the implant placement in the number 25 site. And um, she's ready to go for the um, restoration next. So next thing we'll see is the final the final tooth. So one year follow up of the implant in the number 25 site. We'll take a look at the x-ray next.